Hi everyone, welcome to our first, one of our first podcasts. Uh, my name is Yannick Durbaka and today I'm at the Henri Martin group and next to me is Jean Hello. Trio and uh, we will have like a yeah, conversation about yeah. everything Henri Martin. Many things about the, the, the chateau and the family and what you want to, to know and so you also. For us it's like uh, 10, 10 uh, a.m. in the morning, yeah. we already have opened up a bottle to, uh, yeah, to make this conversation more sure. but fun. I, I have to admit that uh, I have a rule like that. It's somewhere in the planet, it's a good time to drink wine. So there is no problem. Even here it's 10 a.m. It's okay, yeah. it's a bit early. Okay, we can think about, I don't know, Asia, uh, Japan. It's yeah. uh, something yeah. like uh, 7 p.m. or what? So just before dinner, yeah. we can... Uh, and it's more or less for tasting. Yeah. And then we shall we see in af afterwards what we do with the bottle. We will find uh, something to do with it. Great. Let's share. So it's like vintage 2005 of Gloria. Yeah, five. And it's this the is first the bottle time. You, you take with you. Yeah. This is from your collection. So. I always try to, to bring something fun. Yeah, that's, that's cool. Because we don't, I mean, it's easier for us to, to drink uh, the vintage through, through the time because we get, we get the collection. Uh, we, we try to keep a few bottles for every vintage, but 05, it's a good. I mean, I didn't drink it for, for a while, so it's a good occasion. So thank you again. Cheers. Yeah, yeah we just opened it, but yeah, but we can feel it. I mean, yeah. e even if it's 05, so it's uh, more than uh, 50, uh, 15 years old. Yeah. The fact the bottle has just been opened, uh, we can feel that wine is a little bit tight, uh, which is logical yeah. and, and good also because uh, I 15 years old, but it's already young, by the way. For sure. That kind of vintage. Uh, is, uh, but I expected uh, not that much power. It's good. Yeah, 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 yeah you're right. You're right. Very uh, yeah, surprising. Even, yeah, I know what Gloria yeah. needs to breathe and so, but for sure. But, but uh, we can feel it's not too late to drink it. If yeah, I can say. for it's sure. It's still maybe a little bit young. Uh, and Gloria, most part of the time, I mean, so we, we are lucky because we produce many wines in Saint Julien Appellation. But Gloria, we, we used to say that it's a, it's a wine, uh, it's a Saint Julien, so need time to, 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 to be balanced. It could last a very long time. Uh, but it's if we compare with other uh, Saint Julien wine, maybe more approachable when it's, when, when it's young. Uh, but we don't feel it with the 05 no. because 05 seems um, so easy. Yeah. yeah, yeah, perfect. Now we talk, uh, talked about a little bit about the wine. Sure. I think it's also very interesting to to know a little bit more about the winery, the history of the the, the group, because it's not only one wine that you that you make. You have different kinds of wines, different chateaux. Like so can you maybe explain to the, to the viewers um, more about the history, how yeah. everybody came into the group, yeah. who started it? Who started and uh, which wine? And so the, the story is um, my, my, my family on the side of my mother uh, is from the, 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 the Medoc area and even more that, uh, Saint Julien area for, uh, for, for centuries. Um, and my great grandfather, uh, Alfred Martin, so uh, was um, was a barrel maker here, also uh, a, a small wine producer. But I mean, it was a period; um, it was not developed as today. So it was like countryside people, and so he produced barrels uh, like an artisan. So it was a small production, and he had in the family for a few few generations um, some acres of vine, and so he produced a wine. And and then uh, his son, so my grandfather Henri Martin. Uh, so we are at the beginning of the 20th century, um, decided to, um, to develop the wine producing instead of the, bar the barrel producing. So he stopped, uh, he stopped the, the, to produce barrel and he, he focused totally on the wine producing. And, and so step by step, he, he has created uh, Chateau Gloria um, at the beginning with the, the, the family uh, acres, if I can say, and then he bought uh, vines to, to chateau around. Um, so we are in Saint Julien. Saint Julien is 20 chateaux. You get 11 classified growths. Uh, so most part of the vines were about two classified growths. So Gloria is not classified. It didn't exist uh, in 1855 when the classification was made, but uh, most part of the vines which composed the vineyard of Gloria today used to be classified in the mm. past. So the quality should be not so far from a classified growth. Um, and, but the story, the history is uh, very different because it's not so old. I mean, most part of the chateau in the Medoc are 
really old. Gloria is not. It has been created uh, during the 20th century by my family. So the good thing is it has ev ever been in my family. Oh, that's good. That's cool. Um, so yeah, this is so the story of Gloria. So it's a real creation of my grandfather. And then he had the opportunity to buy, it, uh, to buy sorry, Chateau Saint-Pierre, uh, which is a classified growth. It's the first one. Mm -hmm. um, you know that. And so he bought it in uh, 1982. Um, and we got also um, a Cru Bourgeois au Médoc. But today, maybe we more focus on the, on the Saint-Julien. So Belgium is still a very in important yeah. and main market for Saint-Pierre. Yeah. I know for sure Gloria is uh, very well known in, in Belgium. Yeah, uh, 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 as well, you're right. But, but, but Gloria, I mean, is well known quite everywhere. But I say that with... Uh, I mean, <laughs> the, yeah. No, but my grandfather, I mean, did what uh, was uh, important to do if you want to, to get that. I mean, he traveled a lot and uh, he began during the 50s, 60s. And today, I mean, most part of the, the, the Bordeaux uh, Chateau owner, and not just Bordeaux, I mean, all the growers uh, all around the world, they used to travel, maybe less, mm -hmm. for two, two years uh, due to the, the COVID. But before, it was very uh, logical to travel, to meet people, meet customers or yeah. partners, uh, make them tasting the wine. I, I prefer to receive at the Chateau, but we, we can mix both. Um, my grandfather started that kind of thing. I mean, it was not maybe the, the, the pioneer, the first one, but in the Bordeaux Grand Cru uh, world, uh, he was one of the first with the, some people like uh, uh, Mr. Bory uh, from uh, uh, Du Cru Bocaillou, the, the father of, of Bruno, uh, Mr. Cordier, who used to, to own uh, Gru La Rose, and, and his family mm -hmm. is still owning, uh, of course, uh, Chateau Talbot. Uh, all those guys, uh, and, and also uh, Mr. Kaz, uh, Jean-Michel, and his father, but Jean-Michel, uh, who, uh, who is younger, all, if we compare with all those guys, he was the young guy uh, at this period, but all those people uh, started traveling very, uh, very soon, and so that's why all those wines, I mean, uh, Lange-Bage, of course, uh, Gruyola Rose, Talbot, uh, uh, du Cru, uh, Saint Pierre, uh, Saint Pierre, no. Saint Pierre, I wish in the future, but Gloria, more Gloria for the time, uh, were very. Um, but I mean, it was a period. Uh, there is not uh, when they were. Uh, they went, sorry, to, to for example, to a restaurant in New York. It was especially uh, or in Europe, for sure, but especially in North America or, in, or Asia. Uh, but. To, to talk about the, the North America, if, if, if they went to a restaurant in New York, uh, it was uh, maybe the first time the guy uh, in New York received some people uh, uh, from France, from Bordeaux. You do the same today. Yeah. You go to the restaurant, the guy will say, okay, uh, one hour ago I, was, I, I had somebody from Burgundy, in 30 minutes I have somebody from Rhone and from Argentina. So if, now, for eh? them it's normal, but at this period it was like a, an honor uh, to have somebody from Bordeaux coming to, 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 to show mm -hmm. their, their wine. So it helps to, to create a, a strong brand and that's why yeah. Gloria is a very strong brand. After there is many you know, other things like uh, at this period uh, the fact it's classified or not was not that important if we compare with today. Uh, the fact that uh, uh, the, 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 the production is good, so if you, Gloria is something like 20,000 cases per year, which is good. I mean, it's mm -hmm. a good production, so it helps to promote and to be not everywhere, but right. you can very glo be cl very global, global uh, yeah. distribution. Yeah, that's very on. Uh, Saint Pierre, we have to think a little bit different because the the, the production is, uh, is is tiny, so we have to aim maybe a little bit more. Yeah, yeah it's interesting. Um, I hope for sure with with the project that we are building. Uh, I hope for sure in in the upcoming years that that we can help the Chateau or the winery is very hard with yeah. the data uh, we, we trust that, you they, for that. that yeah, they yeah. can pinpoint what to do. Yeah. But yeah. yeah, it's interesting. Both wines, so you have Gloria oui. and Saint-Pierre, both have second labels. Since the 2018 vintage, you just can find uh, from us Chateau Saint-Pierre, which is a classified growth, the fourth one, Chateau Gloria, so the creation of my grandfather, and two second labels or two other wines of the property, um, Esprit de Gloria and Esprit de Saint-Pierre. That's it. Yeah. Do you, now, because you, you, you mentioned like that, second label or other wine, do you like it when people say it's second wine? Because they have their own spirit, their own... Yeah, spirit, that's so it. That's why. And you know what? There, 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 there is, to, to me, two, two, two things with that. It's the, the fact that it could be uh, um, received like it's yeah. less good. It's, I mean, it's difficult. It's, it's not totally wrong by the fact that the first 
label. So the, the main chateau, uh, have, uh, the wine produced uh, uh, like Chateau Gloire or Chateau Saint-Pierre are produced to last very long time. It doesn't mean you can drink it young. If you like it young, perfect. And more and more, we try to do something paradoxical. It produces wine with a big potential of aging, but approachable a little mm -hmm. bit younger. The second label, second wine, or other wine or of the, the property. Wine, yeah. I prefer other wine because yeah, it's right. different. And the idea is, yeah, uh, if you if you buy a bottle of Esprit Gloria, you want to keep it uh, 20 years. I mean, why why not? Huh? There is no rules, but it's not produced for that. It's produced yeah. to be drunk quite early. And if you drink it quite early, you should have more pleasure than if you drink the Chateau Gloria yeah, uh, sure. from the same vintage uh, as early as the, 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 the other wine. So that's the, that's the vision of those wines, to drink earlier? Yeah, yeah. yeah. To yeah. enjoy something from Gloria. To, 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 to be drunk earlier, but also to, to have really the, the, the signature, if I can say, of the, of the, 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 the big brother or big sister. Um, and, and, and yeah, and for a, a different price also, for sure. It's less expensive. I, I really like the, like the, the L'Esprit de. Yeah. I really like it. It's like yeah, it's uh, not so new because other, other property has uh, Domaine de Chevalier, for example, has Esprit de Chevalier. Uh, 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 there is many, ma because vi finally this name is, is very uh, efficient to say what he but says. It's, uh, but it's also the, the, the other label deserves yeah. also attention. So I think it's, it's thank you. Thank it's, you. It's uh, very nice. Yeah, uh, by my wife uh, and all that. So we. Everything is, 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 yeah, the, the, for all the... <laughs> she's sitting she's behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She's no, present. But, uh, she's present. <laughs> no, no, but, but it's true. I mean, she, she, she's managing that for, for a few years now. All the, the packaging and the, 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 not just the packaging, we talk about packaging, so, but also for the, the global communication, um, voilà, social so media. You mentioned a few times now some family members. Yep. So I know for a fact that you, you have you know, two chateaux yep. and different kinds of, you have your sister, you have your wife, you have your brother-in-law. So you don't need to share in depth, but how, how does everything work? Yeah, uh, I, uh, it's a good question because in, in, in many chateaux or in many uh, uh, family uh, companies, if I can say, uh, most part of the time it, it's very, um, I mean, these people uh, do that and these people do that and we don't uh, swap or share, or I don't know. Here it's very different. We, I mean, we are all involved more in the commercial uh, promoting uh, communication part than the technical part. Mm -hmm. uh, for the, the, the actual uh, members, if I can say, so my, my, my wife, uh, myself, my sister, my brother-in-law. So we are more involved in, in all the, the, the commercial part. Uh, and in this part, in this world, uh, we, we don't have, uh, it's not, uh, for example, my sister, we handle the Asian market and I will handle the, the European market. I mean, we try to, so we have to, every year, to, to we, we, we don't, uh, for example, travel everywhere. So we will say, so this year you will do the, all the things in North America, and for example. But we will swap next year or we will share the, what we, and because, some people uh, told me uh, uh, when I began to do that, uh, so we are part of Union des Grands Crus, you know, Union Grands Crus, it's a big group of Bordeaux Chateau traveling together to, to, to have a better synergy, if I can say. Mm -hmm. And some people from those chateau told me, I don't know if it's, if it's the perfect way to do, maybe you should uh, choose a market and keep going with market so the people will uh, remind you. Yeah. I say, yeah, I get what I get, I understand what you say that, but we are a family, so it's not the same. If you are uh, the, the wine director or the technical director or the, the commercial director uh, uh, of a chateau, and so you are really the, 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 the people to, to, uh, to contact. The face uh, of the, uh, yeah. And, and you know what, maybe this guy in 10 years uh, will be in another chateau. So. But in the family, Again, if some, chateau, if some familiar, uh, familiar chateau decided to, 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 uh, to, uh, to say, okay, this, uh, my, my uh, wife will do that, my daughter will do that, why not? There is no rule. But we decided to do it. You prefer way. to mix it up. Uh, uh, yeah, I, because just to answer what, to do, to what the people ask me, so do, don't you think it could be a limit if, if it's not every year you and maybe uh, one, one and two, your sister? I say no, because it's a family. And so if you ask something to my sister, I will know it. And, and uh, the same in the, in the opposite. So you have also children? Yeah. One. What? I, oh, oh, I didn't know. Uh, no, no, did you, uh, is your dream that he's following your footsteps? Or are you like, okay, 
I don't care because it's a decision or do yeah, you hope? It's like a mix. No, I mean, I mean uh, um, yeah, you're, you're still a family based winery. Eh? Sure, sure. So, so the idea is that it will um, keep going. And uh, well, I mean, my, my main uh, reflection about the, 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 the wineries, the chateau, the, the, the family uh, properties is, is to um, myself and my sister, but this generation tried to, you know, in France, we say the first generation, they built something. Mm -hmm. The second one, they developed and the third one, they, uh, okay. So the idea is not to be that third one, try to keep developing. And, and to be honest, but, but if I think about my child, well, I mean, he's just two years old. So yeah, that's, but what's yeah. your... And, 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 but I, I, finally, uh, maybe it doesn't change anything. I mean, uh, my, uh, what I think about uh, him and what I want to, for him. Uh, but it's indeed still early. Uh, to be, yeah, it's very early, but that now some people, they can already uh, yeah. say my dream is... Yeah. No, I mean, my dream is that my, my child is uh, happy. Uh, my son is happy. So I think with that business, if you... If you feel... Uh, I, I can say that. If you feel... Um, well, I mean, if it's it, on, on the right place, uh, you just can have pleasure because um, it's not, I mean, to sell wine, French wine, Bordeaux wine, uh, classified growth or not so far wine, I mean, it's, it's not the worst thing to sell. Uh, the wine means dinner, lunch, pleasure, time with some people who are sharing a glass and, and be happy. So, I mean, it's not the worst thing, but maybe we'll don't, don't if it doesn't like, yeah, that's I mean, you know, life. Yeah. Uh, some people do see some very <laughs> wealthy people, very uh, famous people, and uh, they, are, they are not they are, uh, depressed or I don't know how people say, oh, okay. They, yeah, but life is like that. I mean, you can have a lot of money, but you can also in the same time not be happy. So. To, to, to sum up, we don't, to sum up, my, <laughs> my son, I mean, first time, first thing, I, 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 why not, for sure, but I would prefer if he's a just professional happy. footballer. Oh, no, sorry, uh, just happy, you're right. Uh, football, nah. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm not in football, you're more in but rugby. Yeah, you you prefer rugby, no, I'm kidding. But you have a nice football team now. Eh? Yeah, that's why. Maybe the next Mbappé. <laughs> no, I, I, I'm not that kind of father. You know, I remind when I was younger, I, I have a friend and his father was... Uh, wanted uh, that his son became a very good tennis player and the, the, the kid was very good but his father was yeah. so uh, annoying about that that at uh, maybe 15 years old he decided to stop playing tennis uh, it's a shame because maybe he would have never been professional but he would have been that guy, that kind of guy you organize a, a friend uh, tournament and you say oh why not bah, 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 me. <laughs> but maybe he's, he's, he's still because he was so good but i think he, 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 he ate tennis i'm yeah. sure he's not able to watch a tennis game because of his father was so pushing so hard. yeah so i don't want to do that for the football but <laughs> neither for the wine it will be uh, what he wants, but I will try to give him the, um, the passion, not especially for the wine, but for the fact it's a family business, yeah. uh, yes, created by his, his great, great grandfather, and that is great grandfather, and, uh, and the, grandf uh, the grandparents, and the parents, and uncle, and, and aunts, uh, yeah. everybody. Uh, that is a bigger part of a bigger picture. Then. Yeah, and, and there is a new member involved also in the, in the family business. It's my, uh, my older uh, nephew, so... The, the, the so it's growing. Yeah, so you can see. So, uh, next topic that I really think is very uh, interesting, of course, is the COVID part. So you have, yeah, COVID, yeah. Yeah. How, I don't know how to enter that conversation, but I don't know uh, what, what changed in your opinion. Um, oh, what did the wineries yeah. learn about it? What, did you change something that you needed to change, but liked to do it now? Or yeah. Um, to be honest, uh, the way we, we used to work, I mean, um, every day at the Chateau, uh, it was not the, 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 worst, um, the worst activity uh, during Covid, because if we think about the people in the vineyard, they are quite alone. I mean, they are, we, there is not a lot of uh, uh, group uh, activities. I mean, the people in the vineyard are alone or uh, not so close from each other. Uh, in the office, we are not a lot. We are just uh, four or five people. It's quite big, you, mm -hmm. know, the, you know, the facility is big. Uh, in the cellar, uh, it's five, six people. Again, it's possible to organize the thing and so the people are not close. It was especially during the first, uh, 
the first time of the, the disease because we were a little bit uh, That's scary. surprised yeah. and, and a little bit scared. Yeah, now, I mean, it's, it's <laughs> people died from that. So it's not something to, to, to take with, uh, with fun, or I don't know. But uh, with time, we uh, learned to, to, to organize ourselves to, to be safe and, uh, and keep going, working. So for the, the produ productive part, for the production, it was not the biggest uh, no. Challenge. But for the, the promoting part, uh, the commercial part, for sure it was uh, very different because as, as we, we say during the, the, the beginning of the, the podcast, um, we, we used to travel a lot. Uh, at least some chateaux, they travel much more than us again. But uh, just to talk about us, it was something like maybe if we sum up uh, easily, two months per year uh, traveling to promote the wine. We, so as most part of the people and not especially in the wine business, we, we developed, so the, 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 how can I say that, the, 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 the link with the partner or even the consumers through. Um, it's difficult. Yeah. yeah, yeah, but through internet, so through yeah. uh, Zoom, uh, through a different way to uh, even fa FaceTime, or I don't know what, but uh, to, to get a visual link, but... Uh, That's the only thing you have, uh, eh? Yeah, so during the first one, global uh, worldwide mm -hmm. lockdown, a uh, lot of application on, uh, on iPhone are developed to make people uh, oh. uh, have... Uh, meetings uh, and... Meetings, or even just not for the job, uh, not to work, but even to have, uh, you know, uh, to, to, uh, to share a glass mm -hmm. with all your friends uh, through the, your phone or through your... your so, yeah, so, so we did the same, I mean, to, to promote the wine. We used before also to do that, uh, very, uh, not, not often leak, well, but uh, sometimes it, it, could, it could happen. Uh, but now it's, it's more, uh, I mean, it could happen to travel, but it's more often we do uh, that kind of uh, presentations. So it's more normal. Yeah. So we did that for sure. And in, for, for a part, it was an obligation. But in another part, it, it offers us the possibility to develop also um, the social media, all that kind of things we were interested by, but not so developed. So again, my wife did that. And, but with all the family, we are all involved in that. So try to, yeah, not to be the first one for that, but try to... It's, an, it's a new thing. It's to have something, you know, uh, uh, dynamic um, and, yeah, and share again the, the, the family spirit. Uh, that's why I think the project is good. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah. And that's why we want yeah. to, yeah, for sure. We shall see. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, we, I mean, we, 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 we trust. Uh, you I trust ID, myself. You, well. ID, you, you should. And, uh, but your idea is good and, and uh, it's a good opportunity to, but, but even without the, co the COVID, it, it would have been a very good idea. What now is very exciting times is 2021, uh, one, 2021 vintage. So it's almost yeah. blended or I don't know where we, the we process is right now yeah, for yeah, you. Yeah. We, we, we have finished, um, but you know, we, voilà, we, every year we, we got a, a global idea of what will be Gloria or Saint-Pierre, but uh, at, at the, the end before we, we decide to, to blend, uh, to, to, to blend, sorry, the, 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 the wine in the, in the big volume to, the, to make the, 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 the blending time real one. We try different type type of blending. Uh, it's just few different sometimes, and there is no rule. Again, it's more the feeling of the, yeah. the technical team, the family, and, and nobody else than the family or the technical team uh, has the opportunity to taste those different uh, Saint Pierre or Gloria. Mm -hmm. And and when 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 we are sure about what we prefer and. Again, it's our choice. It's not the choice, our choice. Mm -hmm. uh, we do so the global uh, blending, and so the wine is ready to be uh, tasted by um, partners, uh, critics, journalists, uh, everybody. So most part of the time, we we plan to, to have the wine ready for uh, middle of March. Okay. So it's a little bit early uh, for the time. We, we have decided for the, the final uh, blending of our different wine, but uh, it's, not, uh, it's not made in the in the, in the yeah, big in volume, the, if I can yeah. say so. Yeah, so but it's, it's a, but yeah, we, it's quite the, the very um, exciting time because yeah, we... And so how many people have to help influence to decide the final blend? 
Is it like only your family or external we, people as we, well? We got somebody from the external. Uh, I mean, it's the family. So family is my, f my it's, I mean. If you want to share. Well, yeah, for sure. My sister, uh, well, my sister, uh, my brother-in-law, my, uh, my wife, my mother, my father, that's the family. Now my nephew, the, the, the oldest, because I got mm -hmm. two other, other nephew not involved for the time. Maybe in the future, we'll see. Uh, and my son, well, he say, oh, well, son. <laughs> <laughs> sorry for the face. Uh, no, but the family, we, after, uh, it, it, we, that's funny because we, we finally, we share the, the, the way we, 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 we feel our wine. So we are most part of the time very uh, agree, agree uh, we agree very, very, uh, very quickly. Uh, then you, you get the technical team here, so yeah. we get the, 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 our the technical director, her name is uh, Rémi Di Costanzo, and also uh, other people in, involved in the, in, in, the, in the cellar. And we get all, some people outside of the, of the chateau, but very well known here is uh, Mr. Boissonneau, Eric oh, Boissonneau, yes. uh, with, with, with a very famous uh, enologue uh, in, in Bordeaux area, maybe more on the left bank than the right bank, but I think he's also involved in the right bank, but he's very famous for the, the fact he, he, is, he gives advice to uh, most part of the first classified growth in, in the Medoc. So yeah, yeah, his father, his father uh, Jacques, used also to, to work with us. And so yeah, yeah, we, it's important. And so yeah, all those guys uh, are involved. And uh, Eric uh, is not alone, he has a team. Um, uh, we have uh, Marco, Edouard, uh, so there's many people with him uh, involved. So, but, but it's not a big group of people, by no. the way, just 10 people. Uh, uh, it's, uh, it's big enough, I think. Yeah, and, 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 but the, the people who uh, decide at, at the end, it's the family. Yeah. Uh, so you have some notes from other yeah, we, we, we do different blind tasting and um, brainstorming. Yeah, it's um, interesting. Yeah, and, and I hope some in the future I, I can witness and maybe help. I don't know. Why not? I'm not a unologue on, on paper, no, but no, it but makes uh, it for I'm me. It's something interesting. No, no, but it's it's a good time. Yeah, it's a good time. And sometimes, I mean, you, you wait, 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 when you make a decision, you are sure this mm -hmm. is a good one. But sometimes it's not. That's yeah. that's a game also, you know. Sure. So yeah, 2021. Uh, what can you share for the? I don't know for the the wine. So the Gloria has that. St. Pierre is that kind of style. Yeah, it's difficult, you know, when it's not because soon, eh? yeah, very soon. Um, what I can say, uh, I can maybe I can maybe use another question because you had 18, 19, 20. Yep. Very good vintages. Yep. What do you think of the twenty twenty one compared to those? I think it's a more yeah maybe. Um, but but uh, thank you because you. No, no, but you, I you, think you, it's you, an you, easier you approach to, to, to help me with that. <laughs> but no, no, but you know, but I, I, I had, I had no, pro I have no problem with, with that. Uh, the fact is, uh, 2021, um, yes, 18, 19, 20 were three very good, good year, uh, especially according to the to the weather. Uh, even if 18 was a little bit difficult uh, for the um, the mildew. Ah, the mildew, yeah. In 18, mildew was a little bit um, strong, uh, but but not for us. So we didn't suffer for us. So if, if I just talk for myself, as you said, 18, 19, 20, top vintages, different style. Mm -hmm. uh, 21, the, the weather was a little bit more uh, difficult to handle during the year. Um, but at the end, um, we, we are, I mean, this is the kind of vintage I love because um, sometimes if we want to, um, okay, so to, 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 uh, to touch new people, uh, sometimes it's not easy with top vintage because the wine need time to be perfectly balanced. Uh, and so people, that most part of the time, they don't have the time or they don't know that or they don't have the place to store the wine or they don't have the money to buy a wine already drinkable. So 10 years bef after be bottled. Um, so most part of the time they drink it too young. And that's why I'm, I'm sure some people for the young generation, uh, the younger the younger generation, um, they say, "Oh, Bordeaux, yeah, Bordeaux, it's good, but you know, it's not so easy to drink. It's uh, um, and and it's to me mainly because they drink some vintages too too young. Uh, 2021, it's yeah. it's that the kind of vintage um, approachable younger, um, and so uh, like uh, was the, the, the is the 2017 or, or the 2011, for example. So that kind of vintage." Um, Alcohol degree is lower because 
for now a few years we are more about 13 degrees of alcohol um, this one will be it could be 13 but it will be more like uh, uh, 12.5 13 than uh, 13 to 13.5 so it's okay. a little bit less uh, alcohol uh, in the wine and so it will be very fruity style because That's good. the ripeness was okay even if the weather was difficult during the year um, September was not that bad we are very, you know, we, we talk about August. Um, a lot of people in the wine business talk about August, August, August. But August, it's important. Every month is important if you want to have the perfect wine. But August, it's more important for the tourist uh, going to the, to the beach, uh, the, at the beach uh, to the ocean or what, I don't know what. Um, we don't want uh, rain or, or worst hail uh, during, uh, during August. But the main thing is more September because if you get dry and um, sunny weather in September, not too hot, but dry and sunny, so you can wait for the perfect ripeness for the berries. Yeah. And if you uh, do the harvest when the berries uh, when, uh, yeah, are perfectly ripe, so your wine will be balanced and maybe it will, be not, it will not be the, 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 bet, the best vintage for the decade or what, but it will be balanced. Yeah, and so that's we, what we aim. Yeah. Uh, a wine, if it balanced, maybe you will prefer another region, another wine, another what. But it's balanced, so it's sure. not bad. Uh, because wine is the, 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 the aim, it's the balance. I mean, sure. between the, the alcohol, the sweetness, the acidity, the, the structure, the tannins. So, so 2021 was good for that. And for us, it was a very uh, interesting vintage, important vintage. It will stay a very important vintage because this is the first one we do the, um, the transition to the, to the sustainable organic. Uh, oh, that's important. Uh, wow. Yeah. It's big news. Yeah, it's a big news. Yeah, yeah. The, the wa not just Gloria or Saint Pierre, but all, the, um, all our vineyards, all our the properties, we will move to that. So oh, wow. Uh, we, we started in last spring, so the, the spring in 2020, 21, and so to uh, to be certified, we need four years. Yeah. So the first the, the first vintage uh, could be certified as. Uh, That's good to know. Uh, yeah, uh, um, I think it's the future to go. Uh, Organic, uh, we find out. Uh, sorry. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, to be honest, for us, it was, I mean, for now 10 years, maybe a little bit more than 10 years, we were doing um, the way we used to run the vineyards was not, um, it was not possible to have a certification, uh, but it was really close to the, to the organic uh, agriculture. We didn't. Um, claim anything because it was not certified. So, mm -hmm. but but the way we, we did is the, the way most part of the classified growers are keep doing, and I'm sure they will move in the future also to organic wine. But but the way they are produce the wine is very uh, respectable for the nature for the people. I mean, even if they are not certified, yeah. you can trust their wine, no problem. Okay. As you, I, I hope you trust the one we we used to produce till now and. On, and again for a few years because we are not certified already but we decided to change because finally if we compare with the way we used to do uh, till uh, 2021 it was not so different it, it needs organization it needs people um, involved i mean yeah. we are the you have big facilities so yeah yeah we, we got the facility the people uh, here are Again, we, we talk about the family business, but even the people working here, most part of the people, no, not, not every people, everybody, but a lot of people, uh, their parents uh, used to work here also, or even the grandparents. So, I mean, even for the all the team, um, as a family link with the, 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 the domain Henri Martin. So mm -hmm. it, it helps to have people involved yeah. um, because, I mean, if you have to work during the weekend, uh, uh, driving uh, um, yeah. a trailer or um, I mean uh, a truck uh, or if you I mean yeah it's you are part of the of the the, the, the the company but it's not your company so you can say oh I'm not no everybody is involved and, and play the game so we are really, really lucky for that so yeah good uh, good uh, good starting I think we are just the, the second one in the appellation the Gruola Rose uh, yeah they do uh, it also started right? two or three years ago so yeah. I think maybe the 2022 uh, will be the first uh, vintage, uh, vintage in, in Gruau to be uh, to be certified as a, as a organic uh, viticulture. So we have to wait 2024. We could write on the label uh, that we are on the way to, but 
We don't want because yeah, yeah it's, it's uh, we are people don't we care. Are, we don't yeah, yeah. and yeah, and we, we we don't know. I mean, it's it, when you decide to do that, you have also to accept that maybe the yield will be a little bit lower. Um, yeah, we'll see. And and so 2021 was the first one, and, and it was a very <laughs> horrible year for the weather, a very tough year. So yeah. it could have been uh, worse. Worse, yeah, because at the end we 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 have a very low yield. Uh, if we compare what we expect, but it's the same as last year. And last year we were not already uh, in the way to the to the organic. Uh, so, so finally the fact that we got low yield is not good, but it's the same as uh, last year. Finally, it's not that bad because we say okay, even in an organic way of running our vineyard, and when the the weather is just awful. It's okay. I mean, we it's, it's not a, yeah, a catastrophe. So so yeah, but we move to that, and the exact uh, way we will do that it's we will do so organic um, uh, viticulture, mm -hmm. sustainable uh, viticulture, but with a biodynamic uh, way uh, of growing the the vines in the vineyard. Donc, so we will do bio biodynamic, but in the vineyard, but not in the cellar. Okay. So that's why we we will not be certified uh, biodynamic yeah. wine. The exact term in French is uh, raisin. Uh, uh, non, c'est vin biologique issu de raisin. Non, vin biologique produit avec des raisins issus de la viticulture biodynamique. So it means uh, wine uh, produced with uh, grapes. Uh, non, <laughs> organic wine produced with grapes. Uh, coming from uh, biodynamic uh, viticulture. Okay, this is the exact uh, thing. Wow. Well, it will be uh, uh, organic wine. No, but uh, I, yeah. But, but to do that, we we decided to do. I mean, we 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 do all in. You know, we yeah. don't. We yeah. used to be like that. We don't do a little bit of all in. So we decided to do everything. So, for example, most, most part of the chateau uh, doing biodynamic uh, viticulture, they buy the. Um, the, the, the products, you know, the, the potion, the, they buy the, prep, the preparation, you know, the preparation, yeah. the, I don't know the world you know, for that, but the, the, all the, um, the things, the natural things you, you have to use. Uh, I don't have a word in English for that, the orti, uh, yeah. you, you yeah. see what is in French, but uh, all, all the plants you use, yeah. uh, uh, you yeah. can yeah. buy it and it costs a lot of money, or you can decide to produce, produce it, and so we decide to do that. So we will build. Um, a place, a tisanerie, to uh, to do uh, our own uh, preparation for. Um, to I think it's the most best thing. Yeah, we decide to all, all in. in, yeah, for sure. All in. So and and to be, you ask if there is somebody outside um, helping us in general. So we get Mr. Boissonneau uh, for for the the wine producing for the enology, and for that we, we have the chance to be uh, to be helped by uh, Mr. Jean-Michel Com. So Jean-Michel Com used to be the, um, the technical director. I don't know what he was the, the exact name, but the, the, he was the director of uh, Chateau Ponte Canet oh, wow. uh, during 20 years. And he's the one who uh, decided to move to organic and biodynamic uh, way in Ponte Canet, which is one of the first yeah. Bordeaux big name to do that. So uh, yeah, big experience. So he has left uh, Ponte Cane a few years ago and decided to to create his own uh, entre, um, society, our own company uh, of advice about um, yeah, the advice for the wine producing in general. And okay. so yeah, we 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 are, we are f not the first one, but one of the first to ask him to to be helpful. So it, uh, yeah, his experience is. Uh, it's f it's just important knowledge about that. Uh, it's included when you say all in. If you go all in, you need the best people. As well. That's it. That's what uh, we thought, uh, as you say. Yeah, exactly. Sure. So yeah. So this is the main thing in 2021, and about the vintage. Uh, for sure, after 18, 20, uh, 1920, maybe the 21 will not have the the aging potential of those wine. Uh, and if we take the three, uh, they are very different. But we talk about the 21. But to be drunk quite young and to get pleasure uh, and, and to have a, a wine more approachable uh, young, it's, it will be a very interesting vintage. Yeah. Yeah. Because I very think it will be, uh, I think we will plan it maybe, uh, if you would like it, when we, during the imprimeur, for making videos about the 2021 vintage, we can go deeper. Yep. But I think now we have a general knowledge that yeah, 21 sure. was maybe a little bit challenging, but that's winemaking. Yeah, but yeah, and you know what? I mean, that's the, the type of year, the type of vintage we, we should. Uh, I mean, producing a good wine in, uh, in 18, 19 or 20. Yeah. 
Um, I mean, it's not easy, but allez, uh, for us in Saint Julien, we got many things helping us to, to be able to do that. So, okay, it's important. And if you, if you fail, it's bad. But if you have success, it's logical. In that kind of vintage, like 2021, more difficult about the vintage, the, the weather, sorry, many things. So many things. It's challenging, but at the end, if you are able to produce something um, good, why not very good? So people say, okay, those guys are really serious because even when the weather is not perfect, they are able to produce something uh, serious. Yeah, yeah but for sure. that's why we finally we during the year it's not uh, funny to, to 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 handle that kind of vintage. But at the end, it's uh, I, I like that kind because of uh, challenge. Because what's also for me, I know it because you have big facilities because you have yeah we have in invest yeah 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 we need it. we can talk about it now. But I think it's also interesting to to focus on making one or two videos when we go in depth on the big facilities that you have, yeah. because it's a big production. Uh, it's it's not yeah, like yeah, you know, so it's something like six hundred thousand uh, bottles per year. Yeah. So yeah, it's not. So I mean, it's I think it's important that we that we can make some video about Good that. Idea. Good idea. So stay tuned for for that video. Um, but I want to go a little bit more personal, okay. because that's why I think it's interesting to do these podcasts. It's not like I don't want to be a boring podcast and talk about the wine and that's it. And so I talk a lot. You, you <laughs> have already uh, noticed no, that. It's no, okay. Sure. So you're a winemaker from Bordeaux. Yeah. You're specialized <laughs> in Saint Julien. Mm -hmm. When you drink some wines at home, mm -hmm. do you only drink Bordeaux or do you also drink some other wines from other regions or maybe other countries, countries or what's your or favorite? Yeah. Um, okay. Um, so the fact is, um, I, I have a lot of um, of bottles of, of the family uh, estates for sure, but not especially Gloria and Saint Pierre. It's more the, the the other wine of the property or the the home Medoc. So I have to admit that I drink a lot of the, the family wine, but not because I think this is the only one to be good. It's because I get a lot of bottles. So, well. but I, when I want to drink uh, something else, I I am really open-minded. Um, I think there is good wine produced everywhere in the world, mm -hmm. sincerely. After, I think uh, Bordeaux, France, but Bordeaux in particular, has something that maybe it's not so easy to find in the other uh, place in the world where they produce uh, top wine. It's the fact the wine will age very long time. Yeah. But to be drunk quite young, uh, there is uh, many places maybe with a better weather than Bordeaux, and so the wine are much more charming when it's young. But if so, I, I have I have the, the both taste. I mean, I, I love to, to 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 drink a wine already evolved, but I love also to drink wine quite young when it's very fruity, very charming style. So for that kind of style, I am I don't I don't have any uh, name of uh, of chateau of uh, of estate, but I love wine from uh, I love I like. Wine from uh, from Chile or Argentina, uh, Carmenere from Chile or uh, Malbec from Argentina, and the funny thing is those uh, grape varieties yes. are coming from Bordeaux. Yeah. So, so, but but for me it's also good to know. But because when I visit you, I can maybe take some bottle. Then I then yeah. I know what. Yeah, but you know what? I am really open minded, and and as I am from Bordeaux, even if I am open minded, I am really Bordeaux focused. So yeah. I, I I have to admit that yeah, I am not an expert, but I know many things about Bordeaux wine and especially Saint-Julien, uh, that's the minimum. But about the wine in globality, I'm not the best one, you know, so, but um, more, more and more step by step, and my wife is much more uh, dynamic for that, try to, 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 to and, and also the fact when we travel around the world, we meet some people during fair or during events from other region, and so we share a dinner and so some uh, yeah I don't understand bottle and so but if I have to uh, so yeah I love I love to to, to drink uh, I know there is very a lot of good wine in Argentina or Chile uh, as a yeah, sure. can can age very long time but I have more opportunity to drink wine from from there uh, young and I, I I we can feel the the, the sun and yeah. uh, and. I, 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 I see that you like the, the link with Bordeaux. And, the and, and, so and, and you know what? The end is what is to me outside of Bordeaux and, and not to make a choice between other region and France. I will go outside France. And there is a link with Bordeaux by the style and even the blend. But yeah, to me, my father is Bordeaux, Bordeaux, Bordeaux. Voilà. So he doesn't like when I say that. But, but <laughs> to me, yeah, I love um, 
all the wine from the Vega Sicilia. Uh, ah, that's good. Uh, yeah. Uh, I, have a, I, have, I have some connections in Vega. Company. So, I mean, it could be Alion, it could be uh, the Valbuena, it could be the, the Unico, it could be the, um, the Grand Reserva, it could be many things. And different range of price and different, but, but yeah, and they, they, they use uh, Cabernet Sauvignon. Uh, yeah, they make. So they, there is, there is a, I, and I know in Spain they, they are not, I mean, everybody uh, recognizes this is the top wine, but somebody say, ah, it's a Bordeaux wine because they use a little bit, but, but yeah, yeah, but. They I have their own style, but it's. But we, but, but I, I, I mean, we don't find that in Bordeaux, so it's not a Bordeaux wine. I mean, yeah, uh, Vega sure. Sicilia is unique. So yeah, it's. Ah, yeah, after it's a big success and it's sure. family, it's, uh, yeah, yeah, I, uh, yeah. No, it's uh, good to know, it's good to know. Yeah. And, and also, uh, more and more, some uh, Cabernet, also, I'm totally, uh, but some Cabernet from, uh, from uh, Australia, for example. Oh, really? Uh, wow. The blend like Cabernet Shiraz, uh, I, I loved, uh, and for that, my father he, he agree. Uh, <laughs> we loved the, 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 the blend of Cabernet with the, shi the, the Syrah in France, or the Shiraz in, in English. Uh, Interesting. Uh, so yeah, for me, it's, it's good to know. It's not impossible in Bordeaux, yeah. uh, because we don't have Shiraz uh, in Bordeaux. Uh, you can do, but it's not uh, saint julien appellation because uh, it will be uh, Vin de France. Or you can decide to be outside the appellation. Okay. It's not the aim, but uh, yeah, I, I love also the... So blend with Cabernet in general, I love that. Okay, that's good to know. And then when you ultimately chose, okay, I'm going to pursue my way into the company and, and, and the family estate and... and you know, work as a, in the wine world. Yep. Did you have an idol or did you have a mentor that influenced you in, 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 these, in this direction? I mean, it's not very uh, original. I, I, I don't have ni neither idol or mentor. It's more um, the family. Yeah, uh, for you it was, no, it was My normal. grandfather, I mean, uh, some, some, some family in, in Bordeaux area, it's especially maybe in the Medoc, are um, the, 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 the fourth, fifth, sixth generation. I'm just the third, which is not bad. I mean, but mm -hmm. uh, my grandfather uh, has started, uh, he was not, I mean, uh, lying uh, on the road uh, without a house, I don't <laughs> know, but he started from really the, 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 the base and, and he created everything. So yeah, Henri Martin, my grandfather, is like, uh, you know, like a god for us. But my parents, even it has been already uh, uh, created, they, they, they had to develop and they did it um, very well. So, pss, yeah, my whole family, um, it's not like, uh, no, it's because then I, I, can, I, can, I can say that I have a, a big, big respect for other people. Like I, I already talked about him, but to me uh, on the left, left bank, uh, if I don't talk about my family, uh, Jean-Michel Caz from Lynch Bage, um, yeah, he's a, uh, that's that's a personage. We that's say, a good right. answer, I think. Yeah, yeah, mm, Mr. Kaz. Uh, yeah, 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 sure. yeah, I think everybody uh, agree with me. Yeah, uh, everybody sure. who had the chance to, to meet him. So yeah, that's good. Yeah. Um, then I was also thinking, it's your life's not only wine. You have a family. You have a son, but do you also have other hobbies? Yeah. Other interests? Yeah. So. You have no time. I know you I, like I, football, I, but I, I, I want my, 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 my son. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I love football for sure. But, but the thing is, my, my, my father used to be the, the Bordeaux, Girondin Bordeaux uh, football professional team chairman uh, during 20 years. So uh, I loved fo football before he did that. But the fact he, he did that uh, developed the, 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 the football uh, passion. But it was finally, he stopped five years ago now and I keep watching the game but not so interesting. So it means it was more a uh, passion again for my family, for my father, for, for the Girondin Bordeaux uh, with my father as a chairman now. I just to watch the, the result and say, well, they are not very good this time. So I just say, oh, okay, next. Yeah, for sure. But, uh, but then uh, my passion, no, it's, I love traveling. I love traveling. Uh, so when we used to travel to promote the wine a lot, I, I love using those trips to to visit or China to me is the main example because I'm not sure that I I, I mean China if I if I wasn't in the wine business what has maybe never been my first 
choice to uh, to go to uh, to visit for the for the holidays. Mm -hmm. I'm really I, I love mountain, but I love uh, <laughs> the sea, the the, 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 the uh, going uh, traveling. So so when I travel, if it's just for the pleasure, I will more uh, go uh, at the beach. I don't know, but thanks to the wine business, I, I've been to places maybe I've never been without that, That's and nice. and and I use those time to to visit. So. Been to the, 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 the Great Wall uh, in China, uh, to the Forbidden City, all that kind of That's thing. That's nice. Yeah, I mean, uh, you, these are unique places, you know. Yeah, and maybe uh, I would have been there without the wine, maybe, but maybe not. And uh, because it's not, but when you are in Beijing uh, and you have one free day, or I don't know. You can go back. Yeah, it was the opportunity to go there. And uh, I've been with my wife, uh, for example, and we. We've been to the Great Wall, and, and most part of the time in China, the, the, especially in Beijing, the weather is very cloudy due to the pollution. And this day was totally uh, blue sky, and so on the Great Wall, blue sky. Yeah, I mean, it's memories you keep in, in your mind for, for your whole life. So That's right. And thanks to the wine again, finally. So for sure. Know, it's really... It's part of you? Yeah, part of me, yeah, yeah. in my life. As if you have a decision, if you know, if you didn't make the choice as a winemaker or mm. part of the family, yeah. Which other profession would you would you see yourself doing? Myself, uh, football. No, I, <laughs> I don't know. I, I didn't I, see I'm you sure, <laughs> football. Football, football. Hey. I think we need to ask. It's not because it's France and Belgium. You know, it's not for that. I talk about. It, we have good players, uh, huh? You got good players to to, yeah, to. Sometimes we have good players. Finish second or third is good. So. <laughs> ah, I'm kidding. That's why. But I don't uh, like football, so. No, that's why it's easy for you. We can talk about rugby if you want the the, the Belgian. Uh, team. No, we have nothing. France have a good, very good. Yeah, rugby. I think we we should maybe win. The, I don't know if people is uh, <laughs> interested by rugby, but you get. The, I think they have a very good. The Six Nation uh, tournament now and France has a good start. I think they, they have a good opportunity. Maybe a cup. <laughs> 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 I've I've asked this question to a lot of people. <laughs> this is the first a yeah, cop. Okay, yeah, uh, cop. but the cop. Uh, no, but I, I respect <laughs> all, all cops. I mean all the different type kind of cop who can But I mean my rechercheur. Yeah, exactly. Okay, like detective. A, detective. Know, okay, yeah, that's yeah, good to yeah. see. That, that, yeah. I can see it in the office, uh, spending uh, hours, hours to find a solution. Of this I don't see you like. Uh, no, but but it's important. I mean, yeah, sure. but but no, it's not my because I am too nervous for that, and I think if the people say ah, we say oh, well, yeah, okay, yeah, it's a good try. Yeah, okay. At the end, it will be uh, it will be the cop uh, in the jail. So no, it's on the aim. But yeah, cops to 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 the yeah the the, the, the I see that. I see a researcher. Yeah, researcher uh, try to solve the the, the, the case the case of the missing the, person, the missing person, or the missing or wine. Find <laughs> the, 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 how do you say that? The, the serial killer, and, you know. Uh, yeah. No, no, but why not? But but after, uh, it, it, it's funny because it was. I mean, it, it it exists in every country in the world, but it was totally linked to the the, the American uh, cinema, or yes. because if I, well, it was when I was very young, and uh, when I imagined myself, it was like in, in New York or in Chicago, not in Bordeaux or in Saint Julien. Uh, so, but it doesn't mean that the cops are not doing the same thing here, but. Yeah, so finally I didn't do that, and, uh, and why not? But, but I mean, I have respect for that. Even the military things or that kind of, not just for the, not for the the, 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 the destruction or the, no, the, or the death. Or I don't know. No, it's more for the to, to solve problem, to, yeah. to find solution. To I see. I see. I see the connection. So I produce wine, so you can drink wine. And <laughs> if you're not happy, uh, I solve problem I with it. wine. Is another way to solve problem? That's why I see the connection. I I, I know what you mean. <laughs> To maybe end the podcast, do you maybe have something to say? Uh, I don't know, like a message to the people. It's a pleasure for us to receive people here. So um, I know it was not so easy for the two last years, and I hope it will be easier in in the next months. So we are open for that, so totally open. And to me, this is the best way to to, to promote and to to share the. The, the, the family spirit. Um, I hope also to have the opportunity to, to travel again, not to go to, uh, <laughs> to the beach or to the Great Wall, but uh, because again, it's, yeah, the, it's I mean, what we do today, it's very important because um, we, we, I mean, 20 years ago, it was not possible that. Today yeah. is possible. So we need to do that. And it was, a, um, I would say, a, a free, uh, uh, um, there is something empty to yeah. to, to fill, fill to fill. Yeah. Uh, so that's why it's important. But um, 
it's not uh, that or traveling or meeting the people. So I think the, the best is to, 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 to share both. So I, I hope to get more opportunity to receive people here in the next months and to have more opportunity to travel also. Um, yeah, that's it. And, and, and I hope the, the, the people, um, yeah. But if they have any questions or so. So I will, I will link all the informations of the, the social media, the website. I will, I will link everything. So if they have questions, if they have questions to visit about certain wines, they can, uh, they can contact, contact you. Yeah, yeah, for, for, sure. Sure. for sure. Perfect. Perfect. I think that's it, you know? Yeah. It was very nice. Yeah, fun. Yes. But it was it's the first one that we recorded. I don't know it's the first one that we are going to release, but you know, it's it's for me it's also a little so bit testing the water, so I think it was nice. Yeah, may, maybe you will have the, the, the chance to have people less um, No, I don't no, know no in English for that bavard en français we say, you know, come in. I talk talk yeah, talk yeah, talk. I don't because think it's a situation because I ask you questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah but sometimes I am um, yeah, I think in the <laughs> we were in a little bit in the clouds. And, and I, I maybe yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, uh, it was okay, but uh, I was thinking I'm at not 8 p.m. Uh, okay, cool. Just, uh, <laughs> yeah, no, it's, uh, but hey, you know, so oh five. And what do you think? Uh, because well, uh, it's starting just, to uh, go. Yeah, that's a good plus, one. Uh, Let's do it now. Let's three do it now. hours ago, so maybe now you can see if it's that's different. Good. Because you can see the bottle is here, so Yannick, it was <laughs> like that, and my, yeah. But I, I think everybody got one, one know, and a half. When I was uh, very young, my grandfather used to um, to make me, uh, you know, in, in a religion, in a Catholic religion, so you know the, the how do you say the baptême, uh, the, the in English the baptême. Um, no, nobody has this word. Oh, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> this is the the, 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 the <laughs> bad thing because the wall, uh, <laughs> the wall uh, podcast was uh, I. Don't uh, add too many problems with the word, but uh, but it's a, it's a problem. But when I was very young, my grandfather, I mean, you know, um, make me not taste, but discover the the wine. It could be through a dessert, for example. You know, in France we use to do not not, the, 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 not so often now, but uh, as a dessert, uh, peach with wine. You know, so oh, you really? can peach uh, syrup, uh, mm -hmm. juice, uh, and a little bit of red wine. And so uh, and that's how you learned the, the beginning. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a fun story. The story uh, I would at first uh, told you, but I didn't <laughs> have the word for the story. <laughs> but it's part of you, so. <laughs> so. Well, it's, the baptism, baptism. We said that in English uh, when you are. I don't know, you know but I don't know every word in English. No, yeah, you are not English, by the way. Maybe the wine's uh, already working. No, no, but you know, in, in the religion, in the Catholic religion, you you are. You go to go to see a priest when you are very young, and he put some water on your. You know? Ah yes, baptism. Baptism. Okay? Ah yes, and yes, I was yes. Bapti baptized with uh, red wine. With red wine. B with Do water? you have some pictures? <laughs> uh, uh, maybe not, <laughs> no, <laughs> because I just said, "Don't take some picture of that." <laughs> <laughs> you know, ah, now I know. Well, no, but a little bit. I, I I went to the to the church with my family and classical uh, baptism, but another one with a little oh. drop of. Uh, that's why I can drink that without any problem. You know? Ah, okay, you can go hours and hours. Oh, in the ah, yes, yes, yes. No, now it's very open. Yeah, okay, 2005. Mm. It's not a bad vintage. No, 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 it's a big vintage, but, yeah. but uh, for a long time it was very tight. I, as the 10, um, maybe till still today, uh, those vintages are really to produce to, 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 to last, uh, to, to be kept. So, but it's still uh, very fruity. Balanced because if you ask people to keep it and when they open they open the bottle uh, twenty years after it's already uh, too much evoluted yeah they will say oh what what did you ask us to wait yeah. no it's because even uh, now the O five now uh, if mean, you if you told me this is an eleven I would say yes yeah it's this point. it's a crazy experience no, and and there is a totally big link between between the two vintages except that the five has a little, a little bit more yeah. of everything as yeah. the 11. That's why it lasts more time. But again, 11, uh, we talk about 11, but uh, bargain. Uh, For sure. Uh, 17 also to me bargain because uh, those vintages, uh, they, uh, they don't have the advertising on it as big vintages. Big and because it will not last the same time, but to be drunk quite young, yeah. according to the price. It's good, eh? Bargain, yeah. I think that's it. Yeah. So everybody knows that they can contact them. Please do it if you...
Yeah, that's it. So everybody, thank you for listening or watching because this is also uh, a podcast that we film, as you can see, but okay, also... Yeah. Uh, ah, yeah, yeah, it's the both... Uh, yeah, ah, so both the all, all the audio and visual. Uh, I think also it's, it can be important to see the person that we're talking with. Also to have the nice experience with the wine and stuff like that. So we, we shall see what it, it gives, uh, but I, I like it. Um, and uh, it was a very good... Uh, yeah. We had a good conversation. I learned a lot. Yeah, I learned a lot. Okay, so that's important. And uh, thank you all for listening and viewing. And yeah, we shall see you at the next one.